and welcome back to my channel, The Real Hero. I'm your host, The Hero, and today we have a fascinating topic to explore in the world of technology. We're diving into an intriguing story of the first Mac OS virus. Yes, you heard that right. Macs weren't always immune to malware, so grab your popcorn and let's get started. This video is powered by Dubby. Dubby Energy is the maker of a clean gamer energy drink to help enhance focus, concentration, and reaction time with no jitters, crash, or bad ingredients. Head over to w.gg and use the code THEHEROES to get that 10% discount. To understand the first Mac virus, we need to rewind back to the early days of Macintosh computers. It was the late 1980s and Apple's Macintosh had just started gaining popularity with its user-friendly interface. At the time, Mac OS was considered very secure thanks to its closed ecosystem for your users compared to Windows-based PCs. But as we know, where there is a will, there is a way, and hackers always looking for opportunities. In 1987, a virus called Enver or NVIR was discovered marketing a significant moment in the history of Macintosh system. Enver was the first Mac virus that officially targeted Macintosh computers. Enver was a boot sector virus, and it could spread through infected floppy disks similar to how viruses and other systems would propagate. While Enver was not as destructive as some later viruses, it served as a wake-up call for Apple and the Mac community. Security measures were quickly put in place to protect against potential threats. Antivirus software started to emerge, and users became more cautious about sharing disks, Apple itself began to take security more seriously, implementing safeguards to prevent such incidents in the future. Fast forward today, and Mac OS has come a long way in terms of security. The Mac ecosystem is more robust and less accessible. Fast forward to today, and Mac OS has come a long way in terms of security. The Mac ecosystem is more robust and less acceptable to viruses than ever before. However, that doesn't mean Mac users should let the guard down. Mac users still need to stay vigilant. Keep their systems updated and exercise caution when downloading files or click links to avoid falling victim to modern threats. So here you have it guys, the story of the first Macintosh virus, Enver, which officially targeted Mac systems. It's a reminder that no system is entirely immune to vulnerabilities. As technology evolves, so do the threats. And it's up to us to stay informed and stay safe. If you enjoyed the trip down memory lane and found this video informative, don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more exciting tech content. Thanks for joining me today and I'll catch you in the next video. Until next time, stay secure and stay curious.